Yeah, thankfully, this boy is home again tonight. Uh, apparently, he is fascinated with MBA, MBTA buses, and he has figured out how to use them to get to his other love, swimming pools. Susant Tapa arriving home six and a half hours after he went missing. His family beside themselves with relief. I'm very happy to found out that uh, he's okay. So I'd like to thank everybody. Thank you for support for everybody, police team, and all the state police. And Thank you. The 11 year old took off from his family home around 2 p.m., was seen at a nearby bus stop, then vanished. Yeah, bus driver is saying that he was on the bus. Chelsea and state police used social and broadcast media to spread the word, then set up a command post at a nearby park and started a ground search. The boy's teachers also joined in. I know who he is personally, so it's heartfelt to me, and I would hope my kid's teacher would go out and search for my kid. Susant has autism and is generally nonverbal, but he's very bright, fascinated with buses and swimming pools, and apparently took one to get to the other. That 11-year-old boy has been located in Cambridge. That kind-hearted stranger also had Susant use his phone to call home. He knows the phone numbers and he knows the house address. He knows what he's doing, but he's very smart. Now, Susan's father admits that his son has become a challenge as he's gotten older. He is curious. He wants to go off and explore. Police told us that they are now working with the family to connect them with social services to come up with some strategies to keep Susan safe. We're live in Chelsea tonight. I'm Mary Salatna, WCVB.